Welcome to Voice Bootcamp, a global name in unified communication. In this particular chapter, we'll focus on UC virtualization and VMware. One of the most hot topic in unified, unified communication within Cisco is virtualization of their UC applications, providing a client and options to consolidate its servers into a single platform or as lo a uh, low number of servers possible. Since VMware is becoming a main focus of Cisco Unified Communication or Unified Computing as well as Cloud Computing, we at Voice Bootcamp decided to include this as an introduction chapter for our candidate. We believe that our candidate should be aware of how virtualization works and be able to deploy it. This will make our candidate uh, much better, better prepared for the job market as well as to do their job on a day-to-day basis. We at Voice Bootcamp are the only company in the world as of uh, creation of this video is that we're the only one included virtualization in our CCNP uh, uh, training. So what is a vSphere? vSphere is a product of VMware. It is part of virtual infrastructure that provides um, a virtualization capability within uh, an organization. A vSphere is an application that allows you to uh, allows you to run multiple operating system or uh, servers into a single platform. VMware has much a uh, lot of benefits. It provides a robust production production proven high performance virtualization layer. It allows multiple virtual machine known as guest servers on one physical server. It sh allows you to share memory, CPU to CPU and other hardware resources available on the uh, host machine. At Voice Bootcamp, for example, we have seven Microsoft servers running one single HP DL380 servers. So instead of having a seven different servers, we bought, we purchased one powerful DL380 and running seven different Microsoft uh, servers, that including Active Directory, Exchange, um, SQL Server, and so on and so on. One, the major benefit would be, of course, is to save the number of servers you need, but also to save power requirement, because instead of running seven different servers, seven different outlet to the electric outlet, we're just running one powerful server with one electrical outlet, and we'll save money on electricity bill as well. VMware servers are divided into two, a host and a virtual machine. The host is the main server, which can run uh, ESX, uh, which is basically a VMware own operating system um, based on Red Hat uh, Linux. Then you have ESXi, which is a free version of the ESX. And then you have uh, Windows based VMware and, of course, workstation based running on XP. So the host machine has to be physically run on a physical server, either as uh, DL380 or IBM servers or HP 